Hello and welcome back to Fighting Irish Extra. No, I'm not Catherine Dudas, but I think I'm just as funny as her on Twitter. Seriously, check it out. With that said, good luck to Catherine and all the students taking finals this week. We jumpstart this fix with NCAA news from the lacrosse teams. As the two seed, the men's team will host Detroit on Saturday. The two seed is the best ever for Notre Dame. The game starts at five, and if you can't make it out to Arlotta, tune in to ESPNU and watch ESPN.com. At 10 and four, the Irish earned an at-large berth from the Big East. The women's lacrosse team will meet Stanford in the first round of the tournament Friday in Evanston. The Irish actually opened this season with a win over the Cardinal 12-10 back in February. This is the eighth NCAA appearance for the program. The winner of Friday's contest will take on the two seed Northwestern Sunday. The softball team won their 14th Big East Championship Sunday. They defeated ninth ranked Louisville three to one to finish 19 and three in conference play. Laura Winter threw seven sensational innings, giving up one earned run and five strikeouts. Winter, Cassidy Winton, and Chloe Saganowicz all had two hits in the game. The Big East Championships begin May 9th in Tampa. The women's track and field team dominated the Big East Outdoor Championships this weekend, taking their second title in program history. They outscored the second place team by 50 points with the coaches receiving Big East Coaching Staff of the Year. In the three days, the women's team won five titles and earned 14 all Big East scrolls. The men's team also had a strong performance taking second place. Chris Geesting received most outstanding track performer honors Easting also won the 400 meters. Since 2008, the men's squad has finished second or better as a team. And additionally, the men have placed third or better in 12 straight years and 17 overall. And after two very long games Friday and Saturday, the baseball team bounced back against USF 10 to one on Sunday. Righty Sean Fitzgerald allowed a run in 6.2 innings of work and the Fighting Irish used a six run eighth inning to pick up the W. Four players turned in a multi-hit game and first baseman Trey Mancini extended his hitting streak to 15 games. The team is at St. John's this weekend. Also, best of luck to other teams at the NCAAs this weekend. Men's tennis is in Columbus, Ohio, taking on Washington. Women's tennis is in Ann Arbor playing NC State. And women's golf is in Auburn, Alabama for the first round. I hate to say it, but this is the last fix of the season, but no worries, we will be back this fall to defend our crowd as your number one source for fighting Irish athletics. And of course, stay tuned to UND.com all summer as we'll have a ton of great content as we make the big move to the ACC. Of course, remember to follow us on Facebook at Notre Dame Fighting Irish Athletics, Twitter at Fighting Irish, and on Instagram. For UND.com and The Fix, I'm Ryan Camden. Go Irish. Oh!